Hey, what's going on, everyone? Sol here, and welcome to my run of the Intercession of the Wicked uh, Chasm Pitch Chaos Challenge stage. Uh, this is the challenge stage that debuted with the newest batch of Heretic Quests. And for my synergy, I am running Shadow, Kefka, and Aerith. Now, Shadow is fully built without character boards, and he also has all of his speed passes removed that didn't have, like, another stat attached. So I think he has, like, a pass where it's, like, boost speed and max brave. I left that one. Uh, but all the other ones that were speed and quick, like his quick passes, those were removed. Same with Aerith. I removed all of her quick passives and some for speed ones as well. Uh, her artifacts are all over the place. She has her 15 and 35 CP, but her th uh, her EX is base. Just base, 0 out of 3, nothing. Um, so, yeah, this should be something. We're going to run Ifrit to help Shadow's counters. Let's do it. Oh man, I'm already missing Arden. How Arden was able to brute force these uh, challenge stages for me. Oh well. Alright, let's go ahead and lead off with Light of Judgment. Alright. Now, the thing is, even with Shadow's um, speed passes removed, the guy is still frighteningly fast. Like, I, I, I can't get his kid under control. Like, he'll just, he just jumps up. He jumps, he has high turn rate on everything, except his HP plus. And his high turn rates are so strong that the guy, like, is almost guaranteed to jump at least one or two slots every single time. HP plus, because that'd be a ZX regardless. Okay, so this thing is both blinded and I do have Shadow's evasion with the dog active. So let's see if Shadow gets hit. Okay, well, couldn't act. I mean, I, I tell you guys what, 70% has never been closer to zero in my entire life. Shadow will still find a way, even when the boss is blinded, and even with his evasion 70% on, Shadow will still find a way to get hit. It's the most incredible thing I've ever seen. It's like, you think my gotcha luck is good. Wait until you see what enemies are able to do to Shadow. It's it's unheard of. I just I don't know. I don't know if it's bugged. I don't know if the, if one of the devs is dyslexic and instead of seventy percent evade, they wrote it backwards, so it's it's seven percent. That would make a lot more sense if it was seven percent because this I I swear shadow dodges less than half the stuff that flies at him. <laughs> Okay, so HP silence fell off. You know, I'm gonna save my trines. The Phoenix itself isn't that dangerous. It's the enemies in the next two waves that I'm more concerned about silencing. All right, let's see if Shadow gets hit. Oh my God, miracles do happen. Nice havoc wing. Right, let's go ahead and use that, because usually enemies are silenced or blinded, and there's no need to use a 65, so we might as well use it right now while it actually can have some sort of effect. Okay, now we'll go ahead and try and 
So we do have that nice launch opportunity. Okay, nice. And Shadow Fink should definitely do it. Okay, good. Nice. We're gonna start throwing down our debuffs next turn. <clears throat> Hopefully he jumps up. Oh, he's not jumping up much. Okay. Okay, so they're going to overwrite my debuffs with their buffs, so we'll just have to clog those back up. So we do have his EX, but I do want to light a judgment, push their last buffs off, and then we'll lock in the debuffs on the LD next turn. I'm still waiting. I'm waiting for Shadow to get hit. Even with his evade up and them being blinded, I'm waiting. He'll find a way. I trust in Shadow. He always finds a way to disappoint.
So it'll have a double dodge here for sure. Nice. Good double. Okay. All right. Here we go. Now, this wave isn't going to be too bad as long as I do have the ability uses to get through it. I think I'll be okay. But, uh, yeah, absolutely need to uh, cut off their debuffs, or their buffs, rather, as soon as possible. Okay, nice. He's jumping up with Hava Queen. All right. When he jumped up too. Okay, I'll, I'll definitely take that. Okay, so now we have all the debuffs framed. So we're good to go there. Go ahead and healing wind, battery shadow up. Okay, yeah, no, so now. Shadow is getting very low, so we need to be careful here. Try and live off his HP plus if, we, if at all possible. You see that? You guys see that? He, Shadow got hit. I told you what happened. So, B just hit Shadow. He's got blind. And Shadow, of course, does have his, um, you know, dog thing going. So, there should be no way in hell. There should have been no way in hell Shadow ever got hit. And yet, there it was. He found a way. I have to applaud Shadow. He always finds a way. Let's battery shadow up.
Good job, Shadow. You dodged the, the blind enemy that should have never been able to touch you. I'm very proud. <clears throat> Beautiful. Okay, there we go. That was a good last wave there. Uh, I completely forgot about Kefka's 65s there, but uh, ended up working out. So I'll definitely, definitely take that burst token. Another one in the books. Good to go. All right, guys. So there we go. Challenge stage 100% completed. I also did a kind of uh, showcase LD show off video with Kefka. If you're interested in that. Um, but yeah, aside from that, guys, good luck on the stage. We have Kefka built. Kafka is able to do a lot of work here with his debuffs, um, but Freya and Aerith as well are just terrific. So regardless who you use, guys, good luck. Thank you all for watching. I'll see you guys again very soon. Take care, everyone.